Welcome to Tech Brothers with Damir. In this video, we are going to answer this question. What are the different ways to sort your report data? What is the interactive sort? So there are multiple ways to sort our report data. The very first is uh, we will write our query with the order by clause. So let's go ahead and create a new data set. And in that data set, we are going to use the order by clause. So let's say if I'm selecting everything from DBO total sale table, and uh, I would like to sort by region uh, so I will say order by region uh, I have region column there also I have country column uh, so I can provide uh, all the columns uh, here I, uh, I can order ascending or descending uh, so this is one way to sort your data so let's go ahead and uh, create this report uh, quickly we have a table and here we have a first name last name and I'm going to get uh, the region uh, and country so you can see that let's preview the report and you will see this is sorted data by the region and country now the second way if you do not want to do that so there are different ways to do it let's remove this part and now we have just data coming from table and if you would like to sort by region and country we can do that as well so on a different report items such as the tablex the matrix the chart the list we have this property so once you click here go to the tablex property and then you will see sorting so on any of the items as I said you can click on that one if you see the sorting part here it means it does provide a sorting facility so click on sorting and then add and here you will provide a sort by so you can go ahead and let's say if we would like to sort by region we can do it and here is the order so we have a to z or z to a so ascending or descending let's go ahead and add another one let's say country and here i would like to say z to a so that's one thing you can hit okay and now this is done so you see that this is sorted by region and country now the third way we can do is a call the interactive sorting now let's go ahead also uh, let's go to tablex and go to sorting and uh, if we wanna remove this part we can write expressions as well here so click on anywhere and uh, delete it and uh, delete this part as well we don't want to implement this sorting anymore and now the last thing is interactive sorting uh, click here on these uh, uh, column headers and uh, go to the expressions uh, sorry go to the text box properties uh, and here you will see interactive sorting uh, now once you can see that there you have enable interactive sorting on this text box uh, so you will be clicking here and then uh, you can choose uh, either it is uh, on detail row or the group uh, in our case it is detail so you select the detail and uh, then go ahead and select uh, sorted by i'm going to select region uh, and then apply the sorting to all groups and data regions if you would like to have it so it is data set one and uh, hit ok I have very detailed videos uh, on interactive sorting uh, so go ahead and check in the playlist called SSRS tutorial so you will see uh, how I have done on the group level and uh, how exactly it look so now when you preview your report uh, you will see these two buttons here kind of up and down so if you click here and you will see the user can uh, do the sorting so this, that's why it is called interactive sorting the user has the interaction and he can change the sorting order by himself or herself so that's how you will apply sorting in ssrs three main ways uh, from the data set by using order by clause and then uh, you have on the expressions uh, where you go to table or chart or matrix or a list uh, and uh, then go to the properties and say sorting and provide the columns on which one you would like to sort or the last one is the interactive sorting where you will go to the uh, text box and then uh, go to text box properties and here you will be providing the details for interactive sorting thanks very much for watching this video and i will see you guys in next video